A recipe requires 5 eighths cup of sugar for each cup of flour used. If a baker uses 6 cups of flour, how much sugar will be needed? Again, I've already written 5 eighths cups of sugar equals 1 cup of flour, and we're asked to figure out how much sugar is needed if we're going to use 6 cups of flour. Now, if you're thinking this is starting to look like a proportion, you're right, it is a proportion problem. However, you don't have to just solve it in terms of cross-multiplying and solving. So let's just think about this in terms of copies. If I know that 5 eighths cup is, of sugar is one cup of flour, and I know that I need six cups of flour, really I just need six copies of my 5 eighths cup of sugar, right? So I could think of this as, 5 eighths plus 5 eighths plus 5 eighths plus 5 eighths and so on six times, or I could think of this in terms of multiplication. So if I need six copies of 5 eighths, 5 times 6 is 30, 8 times 1 is 8. Can I reduce this? Now again, I'm going to show you a way to reduce this without figuring out if you have to divide. Just do your prime factorization. So I know the prime factorization of 30, I'll do that for you. It's 5 times 6 and six can be broken down into three times two. So my prime factorization is five times three times two. So I'm gonna write that out. Five times three times two. And then I know that eight can be broken out into four times two, and then four can be broken down into two times two. So my prime factorization of eight is two times two times two. Now I can see that two over two makes one. So I'm going to just, um, reduce those down to a one, and then do my multiplication. So I have five times three, which is 15, two times two, which is four. So now I know I need 15 fourths cup of sugar, but you're like, well, what does that even mean? 15 copies of a fourth, okay. Can I take out wholes? So I'm thinking that I can take out 12 copies of a fourth, which would reduce to three wholes, so that's going to give me a leftover of three-fourths, and this is going to be three wholes. So my final answer is going to be three and three-fourths cup of sugar is what's going to be needed for my six cups of flour. I hope you found this video helpful.